China has unveiled another engineering marvel. The world's tallest bridge has officially opened to traffic in Guizhou province. The Huajiang Grand Canyon Bridge now soars an astonishing 625 meters above the Beipan River, earning its place as the highest bridge on Earth. This megastructure connects the steep mountainous terrain of Guizhou and dramatically shortens travel time across the canyon. What once took more than two hours by road can now be crossed in just two minutes, revolutionizing transportation in the region. The Huajiang Grand Canyon Bridge is not just tall, it's also a record setter in design and construction. With a main span of 1,420 meters, it stands as the world's longest span steel truss girder suspension bridge built in a mountainous area. Engineers overcame immense challenges relying on advanced technologies like drones, satellite navigation, smart monitoring systems, and ultra high strength materials. These innovations allowed for millimeter level precision in construction at extreme altitudes. The project even introduced breakthroughs in wind resistance design and has obtained over 20 patents, many of which are now included in China's national bridge building standards. But the bridge is not only for commuters, it has also become a tourist attraction. Visitors can ride sightseeing elevators up to a glass enclosed observation deck with breathtaking panoramic views of the canyon. For thrill seekers, there are activities like skydiving and bungee jumping. A cafe located atop the bridge tower adds to the unique experience, offering travelers a chance to enjoy stunning views of Guizhou's mountains. Guizhou province, once among China's least developed regions, has now become a hub of modern infrastructure. It is home to nearly half of the world's tallest bridges, including three of the very highest ever built. With over 30,000 bridges spanning its rugged terrain, the province has transformed itself into a showcase of world-class engineering. The opening of the Huajiang Grand Canyon Bridge highlights not just China's infrastructure boom, but also the way technology and design can reshape human connections, turning once impossible barriers into gateways for progress and tourism.